So uh, we dropped the rest of the gang off and we're on our way to the cove right now to camp out for the night and Hunter and Kailani are meeting up with us and we're gonna just chill out under the stars in the smoky weather. Hopefully they'll come out and it's gonna be a lovely night. I'm looking forward to it. Sammy, I love the hair. Oh, oh, there it is. Hi there, isn't that pretty? <laughs> Sammy, you're such a beautiful man. Oh. Oh, Billy, who's driving this boat? Who's driving this boat? We got the boat. We got the boat all anchored up and uh, ready to go for a fun night. So, uh, right, Max. Right, Maxwell. Huh, buddy? Uh, I guess it's Maximus, but Maxwell. Would... Yeah, Max, Maximus, Maxwell. This is the cove, Winky's Cove. Um, apparently, a guy named Winky ran off um, to this cove and. They found him in this cove having an affair, and so that's why it's called Winky's Cove, so that's pretty fucking hilarious. Oh, I can see myself in this mirror. Oh, I can see Max, too. Hi, Maxwell. Wow. Ah. The problem with these A7S cameras is you can't flip the screen out, so I can't really look at myself. But uh, now I can, because I have a mirror right here. Look right there. Hey there, Cameron. What's up, buddy? Got Sam over there doing some weird shit, as usual, and yeah, gonna be a good night. What you got there? If you're in trouble, Thimbleberry, nature's teepee. Nice and soft. I'd wipe my butt on that. It doesn't do the job, but it does the job, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, I know what you mean, man. I know what you mean. Max, looks like Max wants to go for a little ride. Max, you surf it up, bro? You get tubular? Max gets hella tubular. Nature's teepee. Touch Max's face. Caress it. I'll be there. I'll be there. Just call my name. He's, he's like, uh-uh. <laughs> Oh my god. They are clearly being hooligans right now. <laughs> what the fuck was that all about? Who knows? That was great. Some right there. <laughs> Just typical holler shit. <laughs> Got some fruity pebbles. Mm. Mm, good stuff, right, buddy? Yeah. Good yeah, stuff. it is. It sure is. Look at that fucking view. Holy shiz, look at that. Wow, neat. Beautiful, huh? Like it. Oh, Sam ruined the serenity of the situation. <laughs> Always. I piss. I had my, I had a guy piss in this bottle when we were doing our fake wilderness responder, hmm. and the next morning, I was sitting there in class drinking out of it. <laughs> and everyone's like, "Where did you get piss in that?" Like, it's Sammy D for yeah. He drinks piss for fun. So it's a pair of girls though, and he's cool. Oh okay. Yeah, it's good. Good. Good thing. Last part was just a joke. Sammy D does not drink piss for fun or smoke it for that matter. But it would if it was for camera time. Mm-hmm. There you go. <laughs> good, good on you, mate. Oh, there it is. 
Yeah, try to film that guy. Do you think there's more bugs lower to the ground, uh, near to the water? Than up in the air? Wow. Hello. Oh, you got into the whole swim room. There's a duck right above you. They all move with the sound. Wow, dude, come up here. They're not uh, aggressive at all. Oh, yeah. I'm so scared. But look, like, listen to them. Huh. They sound really cool. It's cool, man. Yeah. We don't listen enough. These uh, bugs don't bite at all. They're just chilling up here and they make a really crazy sounding sound. It's I pretty think, neat, look, huh? It's just a cluster of them right above us. Yeah. They're right here. Wow. And there's a really beautiful bird with white wingtips just like freaking doing some crazy aerodynamic shit and just flying around in here catching these bugs. It's pretty neat. Big ol' uh, methane pocket just exploded over there. That was really cool. The natural cycle. Who goes there? <laughs> Hello, sorry. Come hither. My flashlight's bigger than yours. Bring it on in. Sorry, I'm filming stuff as well. Need help? <laughs> welcome, welcome. Wow, I'm proud of you. You're way better job than I done. Click the red button now! The red button! The red button. Have you been How are you guys doing? Pretty good. Sorry, I'm filming stuff, holding the flashlight. <laughs> oh, I'm proud of you though. I'm multitasking, yeah. yeah. We have to take care of my shoes. shoes first. Shoes are most important. Shoes are always. There's nothing more important than shoes. <laughs> Never. You brought food. Oh, nice. And wine. I brought a lot of wine. I brought wine for everyone. Oh, perfect. Yes. I love some good wine. I, I, I fully assume you probably already have. Yeah, wine. we did. We have some. We have some we're wine as well. But, some pasta. Have you been smoking weed, Cameron? Yes. Blaze. Here you go. I, I blazed hella hard. <laughs> oh yeah, you guys have met before. Yeah, yes. I was here. That's I was right. That was, we met him together. Yeah. yeah. Think about that. Oh, That's Hunter and I met trip. Sammy D like this time last year together. That was great. Hi, buddy. Hi. Nice to see ya. Likewise. Ah. Oh yeah. This oh, is yeah. my face being happy. Yeah. Yeah, I was shining it in this thing and doing stuff. Oh. There's so many lights we're managing. Yeah, I know, it's great. Okay. Cameras, lights, all aboard. Sorry, Katie. Why are you sorry? Did I flash you? <laughs> I brought the goodness. These will do for a minute. Oh, look at that. It's just so full of light. Wow. What an introduction. What an entry. <laughs> Come on, oh, goodbye, Max. Look at him go. Goodbye, Maxwell. <laughs> Goodbye, Katie. <laughs> Goodbye. Katie's leaving us. Oh, hug. sorry. Bye, <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. You're grounded. Oh, you were almost hugless. All right, no wheelies on the jet ski. We can't. We always do wheelies. Max, I'm going to miss you so much. You're a good dog. You're a good dog, Max. You and I were best friends. You hear that? Never you guys leave me. While I was gone? Yeah, we were best friends now. Oh, Look at him, he's got his tongue out. That's so <laughs> cute. Oh, he got a little tongue sticking he's out. Excited for the jet ski. <laughs> yeah, he is. Much? Onwards and That's outwards. Really cool. Wait. Oh, uh, yeah. Peace. My peace. My peace. Man, if you guys die, you know, like, uh, it was good knowing you. Hi. Yeah, it was yeah. great. Hey, Maxie. Yeah, so Max. Fun. Max will make it. You guys. Max, yeah, Max no. always. If you guys die, it. Max will like figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> he'll figure it out. He'll go he'll off into the, the wild. Woods. He'll join the wolves. <laughs> yeah, he'll become a part of the wolves. He'll be the he'll alpha be the dog. Wolf. Yeah, he'll be the alpha wolf. Yeah. That'd be so funny. I could see that. No I worries. Need to turn this on. What? Just click it. You push the did button. You, did you break that too? I, think I locked. Oh, there we go. I locked. Oh. Uh, yeah, they're fucked. Just no reverse. No. Just no. Bye now. Y'all come back. So I've decided that I will never repeat anything again for that camera. Yeah? Yeah. Perfect. I don't want you to. Okay. I'm going to catch it all.
as it occurs. Yeah, I gotta spill food. So, uh, let's see, spatula now, spatula, spatula, nice. spatula. Thank you, sir. <laughs> That's not allowed. I can't eat shit. Oh, <laughs> got the wine. <laughs> <laughs> so when I kneel down to go get the yeah, water, just I'm just like going and going and going. I'm like, oh shit! You almost ate shit in the water. Can you tell that story one more time, though. Please? It's pretty good. <laughs> you almost eat shit on your face. I almost eat shit on my face. Yeah. Oh no way! Let me see this thing. It's a fucking wand. Wow, hold on, I'm gonna adjust the focus. This right here, boys and girls, is a is a gorgeous, gorgeous looking dab pen. <laughs> Buck. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, that was way bigger than I thought it was gonna be. I was doing that for dramatic effect. <laughs> I didn't realize that that dab pen was gonna be that powerful, so Do I'm about to be is. zooted. I hardly really uh, smoke as is, and then dabs, a lot of them will fucking mm -hmm. get me. <coughs> oh, Billy. So, uh, turns out we have more people showing up. That we, oh my god! It's a whole fucking battalion! Coming to party. Sure, sure. Yay! Uh, you're good over here. Yeah, you're set. You guys got this? Cause I'm videotaping. Uh, we got shit. Hello, sick bro. Okay, we're going. Yeah, yeah. Skirt, skirt, skirt. <laughs> you got real. You got real far, Katie. Oh, oh Katie's back. No way. <laughs> Hi, Katie. Come back for a bag of wine. Uh, yeah, she came back for a wine, yeah. <laughs> oh, Katie. I love you. Yeah, I love you. Hello. Oh, we got a We're getting married. In. What? Very graceful. Is anybody hungry? Because there's a she buttload of noodles. Yeah. Did you guys make Is there any alcohol? Because I'll drink my way in alcohol. There's my wine. <laughs> I'm trying to do the same. No, just ginger ale at this party. Whoa. That's bullshit. Hey guys, we gotta go. We had a jet ski to get to work. I was home over at 6 in the morning. Yeah, there was a log jam, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> Please tell me you're recording. Not, I, I That's my favorite part, when it's not recording. To the wind. <laughs> well, See, fucking, I go to put this thing on my head so I can try the front up and it falls down. Oh, that looks cool. Hi, Josh. Get it. Oh, there it goes. It's dying. Oh, it's. Oh, 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 it's dead. Oh, it's so good. Oh, Josh, holy go get shit. It. I ain't getting that shit. It's don't dead. Don't get it. It's dead. What is it? It's alive. It's dead. It's How alive. deep is it? Ten feet. Either one, you made sure. You're gonna get If it's a shirt, you're gonna get it. No, I was worried about it sometimes. I'm glad he Ooh. missed that one, right? Oh. Coming through. Hi there. Hi, hi there. Hi. Hey, Hello. Right. Hello, everybody. Hi there. Hi. hi. What's up, guys? Hi. How are you doing, Hunter? Hi. Oh, vape juice stuff. Vape cool. juice. Uh, this thing's terrible. How do you work drink, this? Yeah. Okay. You just click right. it once. <laughs> Keep Hey Cameron! Hi there! Hi! Hi! Oh, what'd you say? Oh, oh, oh. I just kissed oh. over so oh, much you're stuff. Grounded. Make it look like you're I need, I need Here you go, Lonnie. You have to push the button. No, 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 no. Yeah, I guess you're keeping it in the mouth. I'm grounded. I feel like I need to go head first. <sighs> Alright. Trevor, you gonna go? Yeah. I'm gonna splash you, Kalani. All right, here we go. Watch out for muskies down there, dude. For what? Tiger muskies. They're really big. Their their heads as big as your head, man. Oh, they, they got <laughs> they got big sharp teeth. Are they gonna eat me? They're freaking. They're giant log, man. Yeah, Are they gonna eat I'm me? Gonna eat I'm not kidding at all. I'm not kidding. Are they gonna eat me though? Nah. All right. Maybe I don't know. Maybe. I've seen some do some real skin. Bro. I know you're good. All right, here we go. Thank you. I need to go like head first. <laughs> Why is there bubbles? Uh, probably Dude, tiger, tiger musky. No, that's yeah. no, that's just their nest. <laughs> I don't know what 
don't know where they both went. <laughs> They're both going for the light. <laughs> Holy shit, this looks trippy. Holy You No way! I grabbed onto it. We were like five out of nowhere. He smashed it. What? Oh my god, look, the back isn't even covered. The batteries are exposed. Wow. And it's still working. Holy shit. Snags it. Wow. You have to go get the other half of the headlamp. Where I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> How did, why did I sign up for this? I'm way too drunk. I'm gonna get the thing. Who's gonna win? It's Kailani versus Trevor. I guarantee it's Lonnie. That yeah. fucker can swim. Yeah. I try to fuck. Oh, let's see. Oh, it's close! Yeah, no. she's gonna She's gonna win. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, seriously, that fucker is in the water. Trevor, seven. you got your ass beat, dude, yeah. two times. She's from Hawaii, bro. Oh, squid making pussy ass excuses. <laughs> oh, that's really cool. Look at that. Look. Okay. Holy shit. Awesome. Right. And then there's Trevor. Ah. <laughs> then there's Trevor. Ah. Kalani definitely cheated you twice. Are you coming up this way? Oh, you're floating. I'm so pissed. She snagged that headlamp out of my hand. <laughs> I, you grab I can it, toss it back down if you want. I didn't even know you went down with me. And then all of a sudden I lose it. I'm like, what? It, don't worry, Trevor. Nobody will ever know. <laughs> it won't be on the vlog. <laughs> Definitely not. It won't be on the vlog. <laughs> oh! I'm too drunk for this. Aren't we all? <laughs> hey, watch shut it off. Big ass Yo, shut the fuck up, bro. Oh my god. Oh Holy god. shit. <laughs> 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 Do I go swimming? No, I don't want to go swimming. Jack? No. Okay. I'll give you a towel. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look Hello. <laughs> Hi. Hi. That was kind of awesome. What's up? What are you guys doing down there? Did you guys like my foot dance? Me and, me and your brother got drunk and remixed your laugh. My laugh? No way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we did that. It's, it's really glorious. Yeah. I want to see it. Are you guys it ready turned for into more of a compilation of your laugh. Are you guys ready for the foot dance? All right, go. Ready? That's the foot dance. <laughs> wow! That's that amazing. was fucking neat, dude. No, it was pretty neat, huh? Yeah, it was hella neat, dude. It was very neat. I'm proud of you. Yeah, no, I am so proud right now. He like... <laughs> what? <laughs> What'd you say? I'm just peeking at you. Are you high? Look, no, you I'm not. Like, I can't smoke. This is incredible That's right. Footage. I'm not. actually like, pretty sober. <laughs> what you look like. Holy I'm just shit, enjoying dude. life. Dude, you gotta see this later. This is so trippy. Oh. oh my god. Oh my um, god. Okay. Oh my god, hello! Well, Sorry. Friends, Army hopes I am here you. now. We are here to party. Let's party. <laughs> <laughs> yes, party <That's> time. Ten points. <laughs> 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 Holy shit. Ten points. Points. 20, 20 points. 20 points. <laughs> yeah, dude. Shit. That was hands down the funniest footage. Yeah, I've when ever we gotten. look through the footage, it will be 20 point footage. Yeah, it's, I'm excited to see it. it's definitely 20 point footage. I'm excited to see it. Get fucked up and fire. I was like, dude, get fucked up, enjoy being young. Everyone gets fucked up. Like, everyone enjoys life. But just stay out of like the gang stuff. Like, it's irrelevant. Yeah. I was like, anyone yeah, can go seriously. fight. I was like, you guys can fight. Like, I've had people try to fight me. Yeah. But I look at it, I'm like, dude. Fighting, it won't solve anything. Someone gets hurt, blah, blah, blah. 
you everyone thinks you're the real man. Yeah. But honestly, you're not real. Some bullshit. Yeah, no, exactly. I totally agree. It's just yeah, it's no, fighting. It's, just it's just showing you're the dominant man. Yeah. But in real life, dominance is being successful. Like yeah, stay no. out of it and be successful on your own terms. Create your own goals. Do what you and want. And you think about it though, like a more advanced species would be advanced enough to like know to avoid conflict and the always exactly. better option is it's use just your revolving out of it we yeah. relied on it before yeah and now we're going to destroy ourselves with it yeah i know it's because it's just yeah. ingrained in us exactly and yeah, exactly. but i mean the crazy thing is like when you hang out with people and you kind of are around them like you kind of people see that in like if you're like the face the light the light that's shining you know or whatever the fuck mm -hmm. but uh yeah people see that and they kind of like are inspired by it or like at least just kind of devote to change themselves and that's cool about fucking milo he's yeah i think honestly he kind of yeah he's like dude i see your friends he's like i want your friends he's like he's like you guys are real people you guys are genuine friends you guys laugh and love and you guys never fight like you guys kind of beef but you're always yeah true friends in the end he's like it's like i don't have that yeah i was like dude just do what you love, and whatever you love, you'll find the friends. Yeah. Doing what you love, and those dude, are your true friends. That is so true. And I am so fucking happy you talked with them. Yeah, yeah dude. that's cool. No, was, I gotta tell Nancy that. He started crying. Like, he cried for. We talked. It was Sebi, Garrett, me, Milo. I think that was all it was, but we all just talked. And it was, I, like, Milo started bawling. Like, he couldn't say words. Really? But he just kept, like, like high fiving no us, like, dapping way. us up, which is, like, yeah. this. But he like kept, he kept doing it because he couldn't talk because he was so, he was crying so hard. Oh my God. And I had tears running down my face because I was Holy talking shit. so Yeah, no, I'm tearing yeah. up thinking about that right now. It's fucking incredible. That's yeah. awesome. I was. Oh, I'm so stoked you like I, got through to him like that. It was the last night he was here too and I broke through to him. And yeah. I, he realized, I was like, dude, it's like, you got to get, I was like, you're smart. Get fucked up, smoke, drink, whatever you want to do. Just whatever you do. I was like, you know, you're smart. Just stick to school, stick to life, stick to climbing. Yeah. And he realized he broke down about climbing too. He's like, he's like, I miss it so much. He's like, that's the only thing I had in life that I enjoy. And I was like, stick to it, dude. I was like, you can do whatever you want to do. It's like limits are like, it's like you're limitless. Like you're smart. You can do whatever you yeah. want. Put your mind to it. You'll do it. He's like, okay. Like he's like, I'm gonna. He's like, I'm gonna do that. It's like, I'm gonna stay out of the gang stuff, like, yeah. stay out of the violence. I was like, that's smart. Like, have fun, just do whatever yeah. you wanna do, just don't get in trouble doing it. We can go to Guatemala together here in the next year or so. Really? Yeah, and I'm gonna go with uh, Nancy, Milo, and possibly Jeff. And we're all just gonna go down there and, like, go find his family and, yeah. No way. Yeah, hopefully, yeah. Holy shit. We go explore, like, ruins and stuff, yeah. That's a crazy idea. Yeah. I'm gonna go to Guatemala and find my family. Yeah. Definitely. What the fuck? What yeah. a crazy idea. It really is. I couldn't even imagine that. No, That's, especially, yeah. Yeah. And it's gonna be really sad and awakening for Milo, because he's super pick, picky with, like, everything. Mm -hmm. And he's pretty, he's probably the laziest kid I've ever met. <laughs> but, pretty lazy. Yeah. But, um... Yeah, it's gonna be interesting for him to see like that culture. So you're talking about leading that. trad? Yeah. You know how I got a bunch of like nuts super cheap? How? Yeah. Oh, just by that? finding them? Well, I found a, I found like a, a gear store. It's like a used gear store mm -hmm. on Bend. I got nuts for like a dollar each. Really? I got like no four hundred dollars worth of nuts for like seventy bucks. No way. Yeah. And a used gear store at Bend. Yeah. Oh my God. So I can be really reckless with this gear. Now Naked Falls is open, mm -hmm. we can go there and lead climb it, and like you can jump off the cliff that we'd be lead climbing. No fucking so way. we can try and set a bunch of nuts and no like take way. falls on purpose. Yeah. And then we just land the water if it doesn't work. And yeah. We, and we get to get some like serious whippers. Yeah. On legit on lead. lead climbing. Holy it's fuck. It's perfect. And there's some like underhung dihedral on no the far way. left. There's like this really bare spot in the middle, and it's all like Ritzy because it's, yeah. it's not I remember that from a while ago. Yeah, dude. Yeah, we could clean it out and make it an actual. Dude, we, it'd be. That. We just climb it however, yeah. And Silver Star, we gotta yeah. do too. Yeah, so Dude, we should start in Naked Falls though. That dude's. The dude's super chill. Like, we may have gotten trouble doing it before, and now he can be like, fucking go for it. He'd yeah. be so stoked. I brought my slack line down there, and he's like, Let's set it up. No way. He slack lines. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he's like, he's like, I suck okay. at slack line, but you have to hang that the, fucking thing. Can you tell a story just real quick, like a brief? Because I don't even think Connor's heard it. I, I haven't. Um, all right. So, Warehouser owns like, uh, their big foresting company. Yeah. 
and they own like a lot of Washington, a lot of the Northwest. They own a crazy amount of land. And um, between this year and last year, they closed down all of their stuff to the public, even though in the 70s they got this um, huge tax break uh, based on the agreement that they would leave their land open to the public. But they maintained the tax break and cut the public completely off. Like all the roads I grew up driving, like back roads, they're always there. Now you have to pay like $250 to get a key to the gates that they put there. And even if you're there on foot, it's 50 bucks for a pass. It's really crazy. So like this dude went to Warehouser and they closed down this like crazy waterfall. Yeah. And he's like, hey, I'll give you money for this thing. What to take? And he ended up buying it off of him and like opening it to the public again. And like he's like, uh, him and like a bunch of friends of mine were like, really against like the government and the state owning a bunch of land because that's like not how it was ever really meant to be yeah, and it so much is closed off and it's uh kind of really cool to see him doing it so he he's bought, like, naked falls area. He bought naked falls he owns that water and he's a really cool he's dude he's super fucking cool dude that's awesome i've hung out with him for the past that's three days no yeah that's really awesome. he's incredible that sounds so Yeah, sick. he wants like, tree houses up there. So. Yeah, I was like, dude, you thought about tree houses? And you know those uh, rock, like, the stagnant pools of water in the yeah, rock? Pool, I was like, yeah. dude, run, siphon, get a hose and siphon water in and out of that to fresh it up. And it's then, like make no, make it into a wood-fired hot tub. And he's like, fuck yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. How much does it cost? Let's do it. He's like a wealthy guy that wants to do all this fun stuff, pretty much. Um, I think he's pretty well off. I think he's more passionate than he is well off. Definitely. I at least assume. It, it's it's only passion that's driving us, it not well. It makes it better though. But it's not, yeah. it's not like, like money's not too much of an issue for him to do yeah. it. I, I, think, I think it took a great sacrifice to save something he really believed in. Yeah. I think that's what it really took. That's good though, honestly. Yeah. With Milo, what we told him, the night he was crying and like, the ending of the conversation, I told him, I was like, I, have to be. I was like, we're all family, like Cameron's yeah. family. All my friends here, you have our numbers, you have our Snapchats, we're family. Like, mm. if you need us for anything, if you are stuck in a shitty situation, just text us. Like, we'll yeah. get you out of it. Like, we've been through some stuff, like, all together. Like, not, like, nothing gang-related, but we're family. We're, like, smart enough to get you out of it. I was like, like, we all love you. We all love you like family. You're part of our family. Like, we brought you in our own. Yeah. Like, we're all, like, Sebi, Garrett, Morton, all of us, we're family to you. Whatever happens, like... Just send us a text and we will help you out of it. If you're in a situation where you think like you're gonna go fight someone or something bad's gonna happen, just send us a text and we'll be like, dude, it's not worth it. Like, yeah. I told him all this stuff. He's like, okay. He's like, that's what I need. That's awesome, dude. So I'm happy. I'm yeah, happy no, he it. needed that person in his life. Dude. Yeah. Like, and you, yeah, you have that personality that matches he, him. He talks to, to me all the time, every yeah. day now. He tell me yeah, like, what's happening. I'm like, dude stay away from it like it's, yeah. it's so easy just to like you know it's like people call you pussies and stuff because you're not yeah fighting and stuff but you can be a bitch like doesn't matter like if people call you a bitch personally just say like yeah. all right whatever like call me a bitch i don't care like it's just yeah. a word like exactly that's what i told him i'm exactly. i think i'm i think i'm happy i broke through to him and stuff and yeah no that's incredible dude i'm really happy yeah, about your it. personality fits perfectly with him yeah like it it works really well especially have, with all the friends and like he loves that yeah i like, definitely don't have cool. the hood part of him like he's like in no, the he, not at all yeah no, no not at all but i know like what he's doing and stuff i know kind of about yeah. what he's doing i'm like dude yeah no you have the good aspects of him yeah if Honestly, he just yeah. keeps doing that and doesn't go to jail if he makes it to the time he's like past 18 like we can even take him we like hey dude yeah. yeah exactly and just take him along with us and then be that could influence because then he would never get in trouble yeah yeah and so or we'd be there to kind of prevent it from happening so yeah. i i honestly think that's kind of my plan anyway so i think even now yeah i think that really helps him because he's like oh yeah he always told us like oh yeah my friends got the strap like i gotta go back and fight this kid blah blah, blah. he's talking all this shit mm -hmm. and at that night i was like Dude, I was like, I know, like, it's cool, like, all your friends think it's cool, but like, dude, that shit, like, you're gonna, you're gonna lose a life, like, you will die, like, this is your life, mm -hmm. like, you get sucked into it, it's your life forever, like, gang stuff is with you for an eternity, that's not something you yeah. can get out of, Yeah. and he's like, oh shit, like, realize, like, he's young, yeah. he's like, when I was 15, I didn't even know what drugs were, Yeah. 
in Yeah, past. no, seriously, like. I think we got him out of that for the most part. Like, Dude, do you know what's super cool? Nancy told me that Milo told her that he was gonna go home and like uh, pursue his music career without, and he said there's gonna be, start being positive. And he told her that he wanted, instead of putting more negativity in the world, because he said there's already too much to start yeah. putting positivity. And so he's gonna start making positive music now. That's awesome. And like, yeah, and so. I love that, honestly, that's like, pretty much the biggest thing. Like, music's a big influence in everybody's life. Yeah, it really is. I'm happy he can. It really if, is. If he can influence that and do something with that, damn, I would and support him. And he's such a leader though, too, so it'll he be perfect. definitely is. Like, I he is. I told him, I was like, bro, be, I was like, don't follow your friends. Your friends wanna fight. Like, be like, nah, like, fuck that. Like, we don't want to fight. Like, let's be friends. Like, let's, like, talk it out and be real mature beings. Like, be humans. Yeah. And, like, that's what I told them, too. I was like, don't, like, be the leader. I was like, your friends want to do this and this. Be like, if you're uncomfortable with it, don't just go along with it. That's the main thing I preach to them was, like, be smart enough to know when you know right from wrong. I was like, yeah. you're smart enough to know, like, this and that. Yeah. I was like, stay away from the shit you know is wrong. It's like, your friend's like, Hey, let's go do fucking crack or something. Like, out of like, unrealistically. Like, yeah. Like, let's go do crack. Be like, no, dude, that's fucking, that's dumb as shit. Yeah. Like, yeah, I don't want to no. do that. And like, they will understand. Holy they shit. They follow. I told him that. No like, way. Straight up. And, that's like, fucking awesome, that's dude. That's what I'm hoping he realizes. Like, oh, he man, that's what he needed. Friends. That's yeah. what we were, that's what I was really scared of, was yeah. him just trying super hard shit. Doing dumb stuff. I think he'll do good stuff. I'm always gonna talk to him. I'm always gonna be there. He always, I told him, I was like, dude, if you ever feel like you need to, need to just like, move in with us. Like, like, I'm gonna be in California, move to California with me if you really want to. Like, yeah. move to fucking Washington, move yeah. to Oregon, like, wherever Seriously. you wanna go. Like, if you really need to get out of that shit, like, get out of it. All right, time out. Have you heard Elon Musk's simulation theory? Uh, not his in particular. What is he, is he talking theory? about, yeah, I know simulation theory, but. He's big into it. Really? He oh, yeah, I, I've it. seen that. I've seen, like, it on headlines, but I've never really read it. Um, you, you need to watch some videos. He's getting into the AI uh, argument right now. Dude, with AI. Mark Zuckerberg. I'm behind him on both of those. I mean, the the, the simulation theory for me is more like a uh, more like Bigfoot. Like, yeah. I don't necessarily believe, but I'd be fucking stoked yeah. and could totally get behind it. Well, isn't it like I mean, super string theory kind of goes into that as well as yeah. The everything ties into like it to where it's like that's freakishly and, yeah. Which possible. and the really cool thing about that, what Declan was actually telling me is that if that's a possibility and it was like ones and zeros, mm -hmm. it would allow individuals to have, like, exist in an infinite amount of dimensions. I think we do. And have it, yeah, I, I agree too. I, I think it's 100%. <laughs> I know, it's and really have an crazy. infinite amount of possibilities yeah. and without, like, and so we have all these experiences and all these possibilities of life that we kind of go through and you kind of get in that DMT aspect of, like, remember what I, I don't know if I told you, but, like, when I do DMT, like, when I go into that dimension, this one fades away as if it were just, like, a fucking dream. Mm -hmm. And that dimension's a new reality and the same thing occurs when, you know, I come back to the reality and then, like, that reality seemed like a dream as it, like, it fades away as if it were a vivid dream. Yeah. And so, like, if you played that into, like, you know, being able to exist and experience multiple realities, like, you would be able to, like, we come into this world, we have no fucking idea what we were doing before we were babies. Like, yeah. you totally forget that. And that's, we have a high amount of DMT, like, entering our bloodstream when we were born and when we die. Dude, you should talk to Brad's grandpa. Really? He's fucking super far out there. So everything he talks about is like based in religion. Yeah. Uh, he's like, he's super religious, but he has, he, he read the Bible and took away something that most people don't take away from the Bible. No one really? takes away from the Bible. He's sitting there, he's like, he's like, seven days of God making the earth, those aren't human days. <laughs> he's like, a day for God is this much time for us and he's like and he's like and I figured out exactly how much time he's like if you look at this no scripture way. and this scripture he breaks it down he's like one god years this many years and like seven days was like 49,000 years or something he, had, Holy shit. he like broke it down and like was referencing everything and like it got pretty wild but the basis of his argument was that when we die we become a part of this oneness. We don't go to heaven as this individual yeah. and interact with yeah. all the individuals we met. We become them and yeah. we forget everything Yeah, we exactly. Are. No, like DMT, dude, you kind of assimilate back yeah. into the universe and you're literally like, I remember just being there 
not I didn't have any emotions I was just there mm -hmm. and I was like a part of the universe and I was observing just like this hyper intelligence of some sort showing me or like it was like a you know whether it was a collective consciousness I don't know but it was like a metallic humanoid type thing just creating this like nebula mm -hmm. and I was just floating there in like some higher dimensional reality no recollection of where I just came from or her, where I was, I was just there, part of everything and observing it. And I was like, holy shit. And as like I assimilated back into this reality, like that, the cre uh, the intelligence was still showing me this creation. And it, like it expanded over the ceiling and it was the most visceral, real thing I had ever experienced, dude. Yeah. Like, yeah, oh my God. So get this, Brad's grandpa? Mm-hmm reached the realization of all this and the, like observed of all, all of it and came to understand it without drugs. No way. Through study. No fucking Through way. Through study of like scripture. That's and, incredible. And it wasn't just scripture, it was like ancient scripture. Like he went and borrowed no books that like way. only a few people even have and read through them. And he's, this is the guy I'm going sailing with. Holy this shit. This is the guy I'm going sailing with. No the fucking way. Yeah, dude, you would love it. Holy dude, shit. You should have heard Lonnie talk with him, because obviously she has oh a huge God, religious yeah. background. Them talking was fucking fascinating. I really? Couldn't, I couldn't even follow. Like, he walked away from talking with her. He's like, dude, I have mad respect for her. That is awesome. That was incredible conversation. No way. Yeah. I was, no fucking I was so way. stoked on it. You going? That oh, is you, awesome. No, no, I thought you changed into your underwear. Oh, you think I was swimming? Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I can, that's too cold. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm stoked, that's yeah. cool. Talking about like, alternate realities and stuff? Yeah, we, it got deep. Yeah, I remember chatting with y'all on the Yeah. I was thinking like Rick and Morty, like, I feel like Rick and Morty like, oh, no. up to Dude. something. Yeah, no, Rick and Morty, understand. yeah, no, honestly. Okay, Hunter, Rick and Morty right now. They know some awesome. shit. They dude. know alternate dimensions and dude. what's out there. The infinite universe. Did you watch the whole fucking last one? And they like just make it to a big joke. I'm stocking up. Holy shit! In the new season, oh. I won't be holy mad if shit, you dude. tell me anything. But the holy shit! The fucking new season. The first two episodes. Mind blowing. I watched them both with Declan. Dude, yeah. I want to see both. Oh, oh my fuck. god. That must have been good. Oh dude. Yeah, I know. I Declan and I watched both the new ones. With I think they recorded the cat. Did I tell you no what Declan shit, told man. me about trees? That there's many, like, there's slow, like, mo slow motion, motion explosions. Oh, yeah, 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 he so told me that, too. Mind blowing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Have why? you seen his journal? Trees no. You should ask to see his journal. Oh, I'm going to. He's incredible. Yeah. He, like, Spread writes out. his journal in the shape oh, of yeah. pictures. No He'll, like, write, way. like, oh, these thoughts he's having, and it'll be, like, some man's face with, like, his soul coming out in the form of words, and the face will be formed of words, and it'll be in like red and black ink. It looks fucking crazy. Who is this? Declan. Dec Who is that? That's the He's New Zealander. New Zealander. New Zealander. Two days. This kid's Two incredible. Days ago. I don't think I met they him. They came up here with Chase. That was really cool. Yeah. I've never I met him. I actually am making a vlog about that. Good. Yeah, I have it all <laughs> on video. Yeah, all he's a he's my spirit animal. I don't yeah, definitely. Yeah, he's a cool dude. Yeah. He, cause he was at I met him at Silver Star. That's so cool. Yeah, That's we had a great intro. time. I have some. I actually gave him this camera, and let him run around with him. Like Declan, showed him the basics. I'm like Declan, go do Declan cam. <laughs> so he so fucking good. ran off, and he has a whole narration of everything. He just walked around, and like narrated. He's like, oh, this Declan. is a tree, and then and he'd go and like. The throne is up there and talk about all the mountains like that's Mount Hood. Like, it just fucking it's so funny though the way he does it. Oh, Can you even hey, see me right now? Yeah, dude, no problem. Oh, whoa, that's trippy. Wanna see something crazy? Someone takes my jacket. Whoa, wait, where is that coming? Yeah, pretty crazy, huh? Josh! Oh, what? You Sammy D? A Sammy D's leaving? No. Okay. <laughs> he scared me for a minute. Holy Wait, shit. I want to talk about my feelings. Does he realize he's still tied up? <laughs> yeah, but everyone's on. So you guys want to untie that? Wait. Yeah, who's going to get the You guys want to have a flashlight? Hey, I have the bow if someone wants to untie that side, Garrett. We're going to leave it tied up. We're just gonna drive? Yo, let's drive, man. That's cool. Alright, let's go. Yeah, we aren't even stressed about it. We just decided not to worry about it. You know, just no stress. No problems worries. are only problems if you make them problems, you know? Exactly. <laughs> problems are only problems if you make them problems. <laughs> problems. Alright, bye, bye guys. Love you all. You guys are all bye family. Guys.
No, no wheelies. Oh, love you guys. All right, and you Oh shit! <laughs> Connor, you wanna go get naked with me? I wanna go to naked and naked. Go get naked. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Big Jackson. Yeah, I was like. Oh! Yeah. Right here. Hey, Connor! What? Most people think I'm an egg, but in reality, I'm a venomous spider that lives deep beneath the sea. <laughs> Holy fuck! You just blew my mind! No. Itoma! Hunter, are you a banana or what? That too! I love you! Bye bye! 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 <laughs> So what are you guys most grateful for? The peanut butter. The peanut butter. In general, that's it? Just rubbed on in, the banana. In general? Like for your day. Like it has to be rubbed kind of. on the banana. Just no, right. no. In, in general, bananas all I... No, peanut, peanut butter. butter. Peanut butter's whatever. Call the for. bananas. Banana and peanut butter go together. I right. have a banana. But you have to spread it just right. It's like peanut butter on my banana. <laughs> 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 I'm convinced that Cameron is peanut butter. Holy mm. shit. Because you're Holy a shit, Cameron. That may be your fruit. Cause what that goes, is my fruit. What goes better than He's peanut a, like, and banana? Whatever. Like lime? How do you say it? Legine? It could be living life unpeeled with a little bit of nut. <laughs> yes! Oh my god. <laughs> That'll be our clickbait title. Cameron just nutted. <laughs> you finding your spirit fruit. I'm like not. A leguim. 